on board your board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits. Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. What is this? It seems to be a funeral. But what we can tell, a lot died here. This building is, it makes no sense. What could have done this? Think giants? No, no, they have no reason. Look at the footprints. Yeah, they look almost like. Wait. No. No, that's impossible. What? What is it, Izuku? Nothing. <clears throat> it must be my imagination. Let's let's ask them what happened. But you're going to hide. I doubt they'll be so, uh, you know, accepting of a talking piece of Mjolnir. Very well. And uh, then this thing. Uh, excuse me, do you, can you tell me what happened here? Who the hell are you? Are you the one that did this? What? what? Are you the one controlling all those trolls? <coughs> Troll? Trolls did this? Yes. Around 50 of them. They all came out at once and... No, no. No, that's impossible. Trolls don't trust anybody, let alone each other. At most, they're supposed to be at least, what, two? That's just because one hasn't been able to outsmart the other, or vice versa. But 50? That's impossible. Like, there's, how could they trust each other that much? So, yeah, yeah, I don't think he did it. What? Please don't tell me trolls actually did this. I mean, I saw a few footprints, but that's pretty much it. Like, they usually keep to themselves unless someone waltzes into their territory or whatnot. And even then, we don't understand it either. All we know is there was a flash. We heard the rumbling of thunder in the middle of the night. The okay, I understand. Really? Do you know where they are? No. He disappeared soon after. How long will it take you to rebuild? Um, we lost quite a few people, so it may take to a whole one or two weeks. I'll help you. <clears throat> we can't ask you. No. It's fine. Besides, you might need some assistance when dealing with these trolls. It makes no sense. As yes, he's a good help to rebuild the whole area, which there's a lot of damage that has been done to the place. To the point where he's wondering. What happened? What could have caused the trolls to act like this way? What could have caused them to be so willing to work together for once? Unless... Hey, Yonir, do you think... There's always a possibility. <sighs> Mm -hmm. 
You seem tired. Uh, yes, I, I, you, you could say I, I have a lot on my mind, especially upon coming here and seeing your, your home in such a state. Thank you for helping, but if this happens again, chances are I know. Looks like the only thing you can really do is hide, especially up against such numbers. But man, I thought trolls were supposed to be idiots. I mean, yeah, they have their moments when they're able to outsmart us, but even then, to be able to collect so many. Mm. Oh well, Al. It's just a lot to think about. Yeah, you're telling us. Imagine our surprise when we saw so many of them. Which, it takes at least one week for them to fully rebuild. And Izuku is still wondering, how is he going to deal with this if they come back? I mean, if they vanish so quickly, it's going to be really difficult to track. But you can. What? Well, if we believe, if we're right about someone possibly having a piece of, well, me, chances are that is how they appeared and disappeared. In fact, that would ex also explain how so many trolls have actually showed up together. <laughs> hmm. Okay. So we may be ri right about that, huh? Yeah. Okay, good. So if anything, all we have to do is just wait it out. Wait for them to show up, kill what we can, and follow whoever seems to escape. But I don't know how to track lightning. You don't have to. All you have to do is track the power. What? Oh yeah, so if it's the same power that you have, you know, the me power, <laughs> it should be fairly easy to actually collect enough information to find them. Is the only thing is you're gonna what? Since you're gonna have to do this technically on your own, it's gonna be a little weird for you. How so? Well, as far as I can tell, I'm the only one with actual sentience. But, depending on how much this person may have trained, time moves differently in other realms, as I've told you before. We don't know which realm this individual has been using to cultivate such skills where you may have tentacle years he or she or it may be able to have uh, access to a place that gives them centuries if not millennia but wouldn't they be like ancient yeah but but even uh small percentage even if they have a tiny amount of high power they can technically be invulnerable uh, the only one that can actually do any real damage was Yamaganda precisely alright <clears throat> 
So we wait for the flash, hearing the rolls of thunder, and hopefully. But what about the people? We must instruct them to hide. We don't know how powerful this individual is, or if he's connected to any other pieces. If anything, let's hope it's not too dangerous. Is it's been half a week by now since you know the reconstruction. Everything's good. Everything's trying to get back to normal. People are still worried. And Izuku's. Alright. Are we all in agreement? Yes. As soon as we see the flash, we run and hide in the cellars. And don't come back out until it's over. And hopefully. I don't die. Why are you doing this? You just arrived here not too long ago. It would make no sense for you to come here and help us. We're complete strangers. Well, maybe I just want to be a hero. If anything, I might be good at it. Only one way to find out. I'll either win and stop this for good, or I'll die. And hmm, we'll see how that goes. Let's not worry about it right now. Right now, rest. But as a flash occurs, and never mind. Hide as everyone's running. They're scrambling, trying to get to their homes, get to the cellars, and make sure to reinforce the locks. Isuku starts hearing the ro roars of thunder. As this time, he sees uh, not 50 trolls, 75. As then they rush the whole area. Okay, how should I put this? Isiku is going up against 75 trolls, and he's right now worried as all hell. Like, I've never really killed anything that was sentient. Well, this sentient. Mjolnir Giants tell him that it's either you or them now what is it gonna be as he is blasting lightning he is breaking necks snapping backs and ripping off heads with other brutalityness of awesomenessity it's not for kids to, to witness but they would do it anyway just to see the sheer awesomeness is Izuku has taken out at least 25 by now so now it's down to 50. He starts using a new <laughs> electro bulb which conducts enough electricity to pretty much stop the heart. It works and he <laughs> pretty much uses chain lightning. Any kind of lightning or electricity based attack that he can. He uses slash steps to actually instant transmission almost. And as they see that, oh wait, these things are actually losing, they're not as strong as we thought, we were just pretty much taken by surprise, this is when other villagers and townsfolk just start rising up and leaving the cellars and start attacking them alongside Izuku. Though he does admire their bravery, there's a problem here. He can't go all out with them just all about. So he tries to tell them to come on, I got this, y'all leave it alone as he starts to see uh, a little storm clouds. He's like, this is our chance, this is now or never. As he looks at a troll that's still alive, there are ten left. He runs to the nearest one and just as lightning strikes, it strikes him 
and the troll, and they are gone. Everyone looking, trying to search this area, like, wait, are they gone, gone? And seeing that whoever was helping us is gone, too. Them thinking, it's either he's dead or he was teleported with them. Family, they see that, yeah, there's some destruction, but nowhere near as mount as last time. Because they decide to wait and see what happens. Meanwhile, back at the hideout, Izuku doesn't see the Ten Goblet. Wait, no. Trolls. Ugh, I'm not doing goblins. No. Not yet. I can't do that for what if yet. He doesn't see 10. He doesn't see 20, 50, even 75. He sees a resounding army of these bastards. Let's just say a thousand. Him. What the hell? Him alerting them and real near is like, you idiot! It's like, oh, they were gonna find out about me eventually anyway. Him have no choice but to fly off and pretty much being chased with spears, crossbows. Them, it's like, how did they get these weapons? Him seeing a large building, just big enough to house a lot of interesting goodies he could consider it. She just bursts through the doors of the tallest tower and sees that hmm I'm surprised there was another one who found the hammers shards uh, who the hell are you hmm that's irrelevant. So, what are you doing here? I would like to ask you the same thing. <laughs> well, I'm trying to, you know, uh, conquer the world. It's a lot easier said than done, and you'd cost me a a nice chunk of my troops. I'll forgive you if you leave right now. But that's only if you leave right now. <sighs> yeah. I'm not gonna do that. So you are another user. As then, yes, Mjolnir just floats out of Izuku's pocket. What? Yeah, that much. You had that big of a piece with you? Why did you do that? What? Oh, come on. You're stronger than him. Obviously. I mean, look how much he has compared to... He you did say that I could take his power, right? Yes. But you're going to beat the snot out of him first. Say less. As they are in for a pretty much game of cat and mouse. This poor bastard is trying to leave while Izuku is literally following his lightning trail. And it is an utter bullshittery of destruction of his hideout, his possessions, as well as his face. Izuku beating him into submission until he just places his hand on the forehead and absorbs Mjolnir's power. This causing his little shard to actually fuse with Izuku's. So, yeah, Izuku has gotten the Weird old power boost. Is it? Okay, you got what you wanted. Now can I leave? Yes. But sadly, I'm not sure Valhalla exists anymore. 
I'm pretty sure it's gone, right, Yonir? Yes. Hmm. Sorry. This ain't no real outdoor life for you. Wait, please! Please don't do this. I'm sorry. I'll 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 give them I'll give them back everything I stole. I promise. Um, I can just do that. But we're gonna kill you. You know that, right? <laughs> Wait, what? What's this? What's with this uh, attitude I have now? Well, you're being a hero, and sometimes. Right now, I remember. But yeah, I can just kill you, then give them their stuff back. It's that easy. Okay, fine. Can you at least make it quick? Fine. <sighs> yeah, that's done. Let's get rid of these trolls. How do you want to do it? <sighs> I got uh, some new power to test out. I think they'll make the perfect guinea pigs. As a letter ball is about the size, let's say, a small lake. And Izuku just unleashes it. And you can just say it's like the amount of power he released. There are no survivors. Good thing, too, because, heck, to be honest, if he didn't do anything, chances are they were of good gonna try to steal kill each other anyway so a quicker death yes upon him returning everyone's cheering thanking him for everything he's done is is really no problem at all if anything I'm just happy I was passing through but wait it's achieved uh, uh, if you wouldn't mind would you uh, uh what I would be honored if you would marry my daughter what yes please I can assure you that she's a she would make a great wife, and I, I, I did, I, it's up to you, Isuku. Please, will you honor me, honor me by being my son-in-law? I, but I, I'm not, I, I don't sure if I, I, how I feel about being married, or, anything it's well I'm sure she'd be fine with the uh, be, being uh, your wife and whatnot but right right dear you saved it my people that's the least I can do no you could just say thank thank you you and Ness. That'll be fine with me. So, so generous, but please. Ah, oh man, what should I do here? The choice is yours. If anything, if you don't want to marry her, you don't have to. If you do, you can. But what if I fall in love with another woman or something and I had to tell her, oh wait, I'm already married or engaged to someone. Uh, that's, that's fine. What? Yeah, I don't care if I have a, a co- 
wife. You serious? No. So, I would like get to be someone that I find agreeable. She's, she's serious, isn't she? It, it seems so. As yes, everyone is bowing before Izuku, saying, please accept this offer. Why do you guys really want me to? You're strong. You... If anything were to happen to me, I would, I would be honored to have you lead everyone else with my daughter by your side and have your child. Okay. All right. All right. I I understand now. I understand everything. <sighs> you really want. Me to wed your daughter that much. Yes, please. Um, fine. Fine. I... Uh, I agree. I'll, I'll do it. But... Don't be surprised if I find someone else who gives me the same offer. <laughs> <laughs> What's so funny, Mjolnir? See how quickly you folded. Chances are you, yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna have a whole gaggle of whamming. Uh, I did not fold that easy. Uh, they didn't really need much convincing, given your heroic nature. Uh. <clears throat> Asshole. Oh, what's that? I don't have one, so I would not know what that is. Fuck off. Either way, so, um, anything else? No, that that's all. Thank you so much. I know my daughter will make a fine ride for you. Yeah. I have faith in that as well. Siku trying. Okay. I have a spouse. Great. This isn't problematic. Mm -hmm. No, not at all. Great. This was wonderful. Oh my god, what am I going to tell my mom? Uh. Oh, wait. Uh. If you wish, you could even take her with you, and she could be part of your travels. And okay, seriously, you are way too. What well, something happens and we run into trouble? I have the most highest of faith when it comes to you being able to protect yourself and as well as my daughter. Fine, she can come with us. <laughs> uh, stop laughing. Please stop laughing. I'm sorry, but who are you talking to? Uh, no one. Just thinking out loud. <laughs> but if anything... I, uh, I do want to get to know her first. So soon. 
I mean, uh, I'm sure there's a a room in which you two can. That's not what I meant. Not at all. That is not what I meant. I just talking. That that's what I'm after. Oh, so you didn't mean no? I just wanna get to know her, see if we have the same interests and whatnot. Because if anything, maybe we can have compromises here and there. I mean, this is her life too. Very well. Izuku talking with the daughter, in which I'm going to say, hmm, why call her Lenore? So, how do you feel about this? It's fine. Really? Yes, very much. You have no real issues with the whole you could be married to someone you just met and barely knew. Yes. Okay. What do you like to do? Mm -hmm. I like to whittle. Really? What do you like to do with Whittle then? Animals. Mostly. Cool. Can I see some? Uh, they're not that good, but... Oh, don't worry. I'm sure, I'm sure you could do better than I, I could ever do. As yes, there are carvings of deer, bears, even boar. He's even being the way he is, he's already just amazed at the sheer detail. Like, man, if you painted these as the animals, if you had a good enough pigment, yeah, I don't think I would have been able to tell the difference. We're actually blushing this as if you say, but I'm, uh, you don't have to lie. I'm not lying. This is very impressive. Really? Yes. I'm happy to have such a talented wife by my side. Her blushing again. <laughs> Thank you. But then something just dawns on Izuku. He's like, I forgot to ask, how old are you? Oh, I'm 14. Oh, thank God. What, what, what's wrong? Oh, nothing, guys. Just, hmm. I had to make sure of something. Last thing I need is to go for someone who's too young or too old because if anything by her skin you wouldn't notice you won't really think about it. so she looks young and you have no idea how young and or old she could be Izuku pretty much being blindsided all this happening so fast he forgot to ask that <laughs> to begin with like, is that too young? It's like, no, no, that's that's perfectly fine. Thank you so much. <sighs> okay. Now, uh, uh, I have, uh, do you know Thor and his hammer? Yes. He was boorish, as well as a cold-blooded murderer. Okay, okay. What if I told you I had the abilities of his hammer? Are you trying to boast on your skills 
It, uh, well, I... <sighs> Might as well let her know that she is going to marry you sooner or later. Is it... uh, uh, huh? That, that rock? Uh, I am not a rock, my dear. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, how are you talking? He is Mjolnir. At least, a piece of it. He saw me as worthy of wielding him, and... Huh, the one who attacked your home with trolls. Yeah. He had a piece of it, too. After I took the power away, I killed him as well as the trolls, so they would not be a bother ever again. Uh, thank you. Wait, but if anything, why are you telling me this now? I mean, you already said that you took care of it when it came to, you know. Yes. Indeed I did. But, if anything, I want you to know that this would not be a secret when we wed. Izuku just... Well, I guess we shall leave now, correct? Hmm. Right. Uh, and again, thank you so much. There's no need. Please. And that's pretty much how that goes. Izuku gets a wife, and who God knows how many more he's going to gain by the time he actually goes back to Earth. Speaking of which, let's get back to Earth, shall we? As Inko receives a knock at the door. Who is... is that? Excuse me, ma'am. Uh, I do believe that this is the house of one Izuku Midoriya. Correct? Uh, uh, all Might? What are you doing here? I would like to have a chat with your son, of course. Why? Did he do something wrong? No, no. On the contrary, I would like to actually make him an offer. Do you, uh, just so, do you happen to know where he might be, perhaps? I'm sorry, I don't. I have no idea where my son could be, it's just, so, can you please tell me this offer you're, you're trying to get to him? Well, I would like him to have, uh, this. So, what is it? It's a recommendation for UA, of course. With this, he won't have to worry about taking the exam or anything. At least, not the normal one. There's a separate exam for recommendations, in which I would like him to actually take it, just to show how, well, capable he is. If you don't mind, uh, would you please uh, give that to him? Uh, I, yes, of course, yes, I'll, I'll, I'll be sure that he receives it, but, uh, um, uh, can you leave now? I have, I have a lot to, what, oh, oh, right, right. If anything, 
makes perfect sense. Just please let him know that I would also like to have a little chat with him as far as being a hero is concerned. Now with that, that is when All Might leaves. Upset, I can't believe I missed him. <laughs>